Hello, this is Brian from buddy-baker.us and today I thought I'd do a video to let people know what I plan on doing in the near future for BBUS as far as the website and the blog are concerned. Um, as you probably know, uh, I've been doing blog, I've been blogging since approximately 2010, 2011. Um, the blog has been used pretty close to, pretty close to regularly on a re very regular basis. In the last couple of months, I have uh, had to deal with some issues regarding uh, uptime and stability. However, I've taken care of those issues, I believe. Um, however, um, the one thing that seems to be uh, on the back burner at this point is the BBUS website. And what I'd like to be able to do is I'd like to be able to transition that website away from using Web Studio 5. Although Web Studio 5 is a very powerful program used to be able to build websites, I believe that Dreamweaver can do more than what uh, can do most of what uh, Web Studio 5 can do and can also do more. Um, so what I'd like to be able to do in the next few months um, is to try to find some time to go in there and physically uh, transition that website um, move files over, uh, make changes to the content of the website, make uh, make buttons and other types of things, pull down menus and the whole nine yards to try to make the site a little bit more inviting. Uh, chief among these things that I'd also like to be able to do is go in there and try to change some of the content of the website since the website has been up since about 2009. Um, some of the content is, uh, some of the content might be accurate um, the websites uh, appear to be the websites on the website that are linked seem to be uh, perfectly okay as far as uh, not having any 404s so that seems to be okay but what I want to be able to do eventually is to change this website out and make the website uh, more along the lines of a Dreamweaver website for CS, CS5 um, which matches my other website that I am working on and as I work on other websites I will be transitioning those to Dreamweaver as well. Um, and this way I'll be able to maintain the website with one, one uh, maintain websites with one web, web design software and if there's a piece of, of a website that I would like to try to uh, add to my own I can actually find out how to do that quite easily uh, by adding scripts in the whole nine yards. So um, and when I begin to do the when I begin to do this work what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, probably post either a web video or uh, put, place a blog post in there telling people about what I'm going to do and I'm going to move the old website out of its current directory to another directory and then I'm going to start from scratch I'm going to build a new website using Dreamweaver and I'm going to uh, um, use as many of my uh, JPEG images and, and other types of things on the website as possible um, and I'm going to try to update the information uh, as I said most of it is quite old um, some of it may not be as accurate as it once was and this is one of my one of my draws for trying to fix the website so that this information is actually accurate and up to date. Uh, one of the problems, as many of you probably know and understand, is as a website, you can put anybody can put a website online and and have it sitting there and have it work. The problem that I probably will have is, and other people have, is if they don't update their websites on a regular basis. The, the information on the website gets stale and you end up with the same old information. Some of the information, most of the information that I have on the website has been blog uh, transformed so most of that stuff is actually in my on my blog pages and uh, some of it some of it I've just linked from some of the important pages I've just linked from my blog to the actual page on the website. But as I said, I, as, as time goes on, I will try to make those changes to the website, um, cleaning, up the, cleaning up the formatting and other type of stuff, because uh, at this point it looks just like a big white sheet, and, I, and, it, and it just doesn't look too inviting. So I'd like to be able to make that change. 
um, and I just wanted to let people know that we are going to be making changes to BBUS's website. Uh, this has been Brian from buddy-baker.us, and I look forward to hearing from you in the near future. Bye for now.